education can play an important role in improving the conditions for learning. In increasing the sharing of this learning along the lines of intercultural education and in equalizing opportunities for learning and for meaningful participation among all members of society. My channel is to provide you with the topics which call the ingredients of adult education, which you might find useful, relevant, and ideas for what you need for your organization and sometimes for yourself. Adult education ingredients provides hints for what you need to improve in yourself as you participate in your workforce, participate in your society, and perhaps in governmental role. Today, I'm going to focus on community-based approach to education or literacy programs. Community-based approach to literacy programs could enhance cultural understanding and life experience through knowledge interactions such as reading, writing, and oral communication. Community-based education or literacy programs could range from teaching migrant English, YMCA, women group, cooking class, you name it as you go. There are so many varieties, but the main focus is on what is the advantages of community-based education. The abbreviation for community-based education is CBE. The main focus of CBE is to build connection between the communities starts from the classroom. For more information, watch my previous videos on successful community interaction using community-based approach to literacy programs from the video link above. For more professional approach to CBE that is community-based education, there should be a systematic approach and intentional approach before starting CBE. So what are really systematic and intentional approaches got to do with CBE? Systematic approach is to collect data, documenting experiences inside and outside of the classroom before the literacy programs are implemented. Intentional approach is overall the planned research in what teachers should teach and the activities implemented. For more information on inquiry-based professional development, watch the video for the video link above. For example, in the migrant community-based education, the appropriate strategy to work on, use cultural diversity approach to work on the culture, region, religion, age, time spent in the present country to work out the classification groups. The classification groups help individuals to make friends with other individuals who has a similar background, etc. The classification groups also help the teacher to prepare the right material for teaching. There will be time for all groups come together to expose to English language and main culture or mainstream culture. There should be training for the participants who train the teacher to work for the CBE. For example, how to connect the cultural groups to the mainstream culture, how to assess and using oral and written feedback, how to use community topics and issues in their work, and how to raise capitals to pay the teacher who needs curricular planning time. For more information on community-based education, watch my previous video on community-based organization and community-based education from the video link above. Finally, thank you so much for your participation, watching and listening. Until next time.